All right, guys. So we're here uh, back in the car in Barbells and Burnouts. So I'm here with the uh, Will here in the Skyline. And, you know, it's fun just walking around, can uh, well, driving around town and campus. Everybody looks at you, looks at me in the passenger, well, technically passenger seat. Everybody's like, "How are you not driving?" I'm just waving at them. They look at me stupid. It's fun. I can't wait to get my skeleton in the passenger seat over there. <laughs> with a cigarette in his hand, have his arm propped up. I'm like, oh god! <laughs> I need to get a steering wheel. So we'll just be here, just that'd be make a right right here. There you go. Oh, perfect! That takes you. Yeah. Just take it out of the photo. Uh, they gave me that as a door prize in the car, yes. So, apparently, guys, I didn't even realize I didn't have an alternator belt. I don't know if y'all can see that. Oh, that's your flux capacitor. It takes you back in time, especially if you got stuff like that oh, yeah. playing. Go over 80 miles per hour. All right, so let's uh, start on this fuel pump. So my homeboy, 88. Go back in time. So on there. Yes. Always get your gloves. Always get your gloves. You know what's going? Funny. Getting it up on the ramp. Oh, would you look at that? Oh. Take off. So I didn't even know the fuel, I thought we had to lift the car to get to the fuel pump, but I'm probably thinking of a, what, uh, yeah. Alright, let me run through this real quick. Alright, so right here, guys, is my fuel pump. Um, I was having issues, I don't know if you guys can see this, but that's how much fuel is in it right now. That is terrible. Let me focus on that. You know, um, look at the pump position for you. Yeah? I don't know how these are for, like, mine. Turbo diesel in my truck I put in. Uh, mm -hmm. It was a mechanical fuel pump. And they had to be primed like perfect before they start pulling fuel in. Yeah. Um, I'm wondering if maybe kind of. Oh, well, we'll see. Because yeah. so, I'm going to prime it anyways before get some good sucking going on before we hit. Some good suction on it? Good sucking. Oh, good sucking! <laughs> Give it a good sucking. I'll put a breather on this thing before I drop it. Suck some little mighty gremlins down. <laughs> You'll think you got something over there. I think you got it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Pumping everything. <laughs> Look at all that gas not being pumped in. All the juices for the motor. Alright, so the rod fell in. So much we had to take the face plate off. Oh! But the plate, the rod fell in. So we have to take the face plate off and go grab it. So. Boom! Boom! Went right back in the hole. Don't you dare do it. You better do it for Dale and stay up there. Mm hmm. Tell him. All right, guys. So it's now a few days later. Uh, we got rained out last time. That's why it's so bright. I'm wearing different clothes, obviously. Ooh, it's just because clearly this is a sissy. No, 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 no. It was raining. It started raining. And I ain't got no tarp. I ain't feel like doing it. Call me what you want, all right? So we're about to throw the fuel pump in. And I might, may, may or may not go grab a belt today. Not sure. Yep. Dubs over there. All right. <laughs> this sucks. Yeah, I can probably get better pliers to do this with, but kind of had to grab everything and run because I've been working on that Genesis Turbo build. Did it work out? Did you get the easy yeah. off? Oh, yeah, I got it off. It's already mailed off. True. Just remember where that goes. No! Not the fuel! I just, press, that. I just pressed record too. <laughs> yep. So uh, we kind of almost drained the fuel out. <laughs> Fuel's important. Oh my god, it's still <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> oh dang, now I gotta put that out. <laughs> I didn't press that. No, me, me, I did. <laughs> so we're over here struggling. We're trying to get set out this valve that's on the fuel pump, on the neck of the fuel pump to fit right over there on the fuel pump. 
We're trying to get it off, but that thing is literally rusted on there. So yeah. So we don't know what anything in here goes to. Well, ah! <laughs> oh god, <laughs> don't die, no! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> So we got the fuel pump in, just placing the gasket on there, ever so nicely. Right oh. Oh, yeah. in the tear. Yeah. Cheap condom. Yeah, you don't like those. You have you end up with 16 kids and wondering why your life is the way it is. You just have a sad thing I share. It's like mother of twins gets birth to triplets. <laughs> mother of triplets gives gives birth to quadruplets. That dude sitting over there all the way like, and he's just like, <laughs> <laughs> "What did I do wrong?" <laughs> all that, and that was the, uh... All right, guys. So we got the fuel pump on. Um, do the battery in as well. About to just fire it up and see what happens. You know, just hopefully she should run. She should probably take a minute to start. Take a minute. Yeah, just get all the air out of it. Yeah. Or it'll start right up. I don't know. <laughs> do it for Dale. And, do yeah. it for Dale. Get his here particular Camaro running. Don't touch. Heck of a fan up here. Sounds like a 747. Oh god. Anyways, guys, <laughs> we tried to start it, and I have no idea why it's not starting. What do you think? What do you think? It's not starting. Uh, GM. GM. Uh, because car. Because car. Because missing details. Because yeah. you don't have a mullet. You oh. got the beard. You got the. I don't chin have mullet. my mullet's not. Yeah, my chin That's mullet why it covers won't run. it. But you got in it, and it realized. Guy, don't have a mullet. Yeah, that's probably why. Because Sasha has his dreads, so it counts exactly. as a mullet. That's a mullet. But yeah, so um, you gotta you gotta like have a pit bald eagle that rides on your shoulder and wear your mullet. <laughs> but um, GM, you're failing me. But um, so yeah, uh, we, I guess we're just waiting for the choke to cool down. Cause oh my gosh, it's extremely hot right now. So it's running now. We gotta get up. It was what the choke. And you want the. Oh. It was uh, something to do with the advance on the distributor. Something wasn't plugged up properly, and it was hidden off behind the distributor. Yeah, so we got all the all the air out yeah. of the fuel, which was a very important thing to do before yeah. it started. Anyway, so we just sit there and like, blah, 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 yeah. and waiting for like. Yeah, I just, we're just about to go get the uh, belt now, the alternator belt, and throw that on there because oh shoot, I left it plugged up. Should be fine. Look, 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 look. The car plugged up. Oh yeah, I'll fix that. That choke being stuck on all the time was what did it. Oh, okay. We'll hook it up to the switch. Yeah. Randy probably will need it for a while. Yeah. Uh, Alright, so basically, we got it running. Easy E? Yeah. he would be killing it. Dude, all these other people be out of a job. <laughs> yeah. So we got the, um, car running so I definitely just moved it you know moved it over here but we're about to put the alternator belt on as well so you see it right there you know we're going to pump that thing on there right there.
All right, guys. So this is where I'm gonna end this video. Uh, Will just want me to show him on camera. Say, no. everybody, say bye. Look, hey, I'm gonna use your back right there. So everybody, say bye to Will. Bye, Will. All right, guys. So if you shut up, you got a four cylinder. But if you guys enjoy this content, remember to share, subscribe, like, and let's get to 500 subs by the end of the year. All right? Let's peace out.